The Onzo Arms is very much focused around its smokehouse menu um, and we try to involve all ages in that, from newborns all the way through to 99 years plus, as, uh, as Lego would say. So uh, we have our vast kind of gardens with a canal setting as well, um, but also we have a beautiful river which is just behind us and uh, of course our two goats, Pops and Barley. So uh, I used to work for a company called Merlin Entertainment, who are the second biggest leisure operator in the world. And I spent a numerous uh, number of my uh, early years there. And we were uh, up in Malton, up in Yorkshire. And I thought, well, I'll put my surname to good use, B-A-R-R, -R, so why not go, go run a bar? And that's, that's kind of the main story. And I've been here now for three years. And yeah, it's been a pleasure ever since. I believe we've been nominated for the Family Award uh, because we, we provide that ultimate setting for families. We have the beautiful Way and Erin Canal just behind us, and we have the river as well, and we have some great facilities and, and a menu that suits families for all occasions. We enable children to run around in both gardens. They have some great play area, but then also, as I said before, the beautiful hops and barley. I mean, it's just been an absolute pleasure and an honour to be nominated and going through and listed as a finalist. I mean, that's huge uh, throughout the whole kind of of, of the UK. Um, but to win would be, uh, you know, would really, really top what has been a challenging 18 months. I think there's a lot of highs um, and that's what we all need to take as an industry away from this. You know, the positivity from the communities that have come to support us, the Eat Out to Help Out scheme where people flooded back to beautiful places like this and many others around the country as well. But that sheer community spirit, I think that's the real positive to take from all of this and shows that pubs really do have a heart in the British public.